Cone Bonwa, good evening, Pathless. It is I, Loki the Mad Titan. <laughs> oh my god, and welcome to episode. Could you stop whistling, please? Welcome to episode 45. <laughs> episode 45 of Enderall Forgotten Stories, the Skyrim conversion mod. We're standing here in front of poor Darius, who may or may not have murdered his brother. We'll never know. So I did look this uh, up a little bit and do a little bit more research. And yeah, this quest was left open-ended, you know, for the most part. Um, apparently there wasn't a definitive answer who committed the murder. So you could choose or just check it out like I did and let them choose. Or you could speculate uh, all you want, but there's no clear canon, uh, again, from what I read answer as to who committed the murder so sadly poor Darius lost his brother if he didn't commit the murder and now is in prison um thanks thanks for thanks for whistling during my intro I appreciate that watchdog we are here in Duneville we deviated from the main quest yet again uh I feel like a good reason why I do that is there's so many side quests and I am doing the main quest in the rim and like a bunch of crazy stuff just oh my god a bunch of crazy stuff just happened in the last episode that made it I can't there's just too many that made it seem like uh, we would not be able to do some other quests. I don't know if that's true or not, but it was uh, uh, some big stuff went down that kind of like locked off an entire major area in the storyline of the rim. So it, it, if you understand why sometimes I'm nervous about progressing the main quest uh, too far forward, it's because I don't want to mess anything up. Since I am playing everything blind, pity. He was a good man. I, okay, well, I'm trying to look at your tattoos, Mike Tyson. All right, relax. All right, so we have to figure out what we are doing this episode. Yeah, I was I was kind of left a little flustered, I guess, by the way that uh, that quest ended because I felt like I might have messed something up. Because normally if something goes wrong, it's because it's something that I did. Uh, but that was not... That was actually not the case for once. It was just how the quest was scripted. So let's take a quick peek and see what we're doing here. So we have all of the ingredients to bring uh, Mal Doloran... Oh my god, Doloran. Dal Mal Doloran. Some of these names, man. I want to I wanna try to, you know... Do like a uh, Enderall name saying challenge to see. I'm sure other people can say them better than me because I, I know I'm butchering them literally every episode. But uh, some of them quite challenging. So if we do this, since we have these, this one it says in Duneville I found a letter from somebody who is planning an excavation expedition. Jesus. Uh, <laughs> reason being, an heirloom which he suspects is located in a pirate ruin called Old Sultrius. Apparently, one has to solve several puzzles. Oh, that should be a nightmare for me. All right, where's? All right, let's look at that one first. Puzzles. I mean, I like puzzles. That's not that far away. All right, and where was the other one? Look, I'm hitting the right buttons. Something must be wrong with me. I must be sick today. All right, that that one's all the way back in Ark, so we can use a teleportation spell to get there so let's let's do the puzzle one first because we're at the uh, interlude which I feel like seems like an important spot I have no idea how far I am into this if you're new to the channel those are roast going to guys you must if you're new to the series as Jimmy Masha and if you were regular uh, and there's a fair amount of regulars here uh, Lewin mrs. Foyce Teresa Clara Isabella um, Oh, buh, 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 buh. I always feel like I'm forgetting people, and I probably am. 
And if I do, please, please forgive me. I, I do most of this off the top of my head. I do have my cheat sheet to help me remember new subscribers. But when I do this part, it's just me trying to use my brain. And we know, <laughs> we know how well that works sometimes or doesn't work sometimes. Uh... If there's anybody else, I'm, I'm just totally blinking. I know there are other people that watch this series, and if anybody's watching this series, greatly appreciate it. I normally try to shout out the people that, you know, comment and try to help me along a little bit as I'm figuring or failing. Oh, Volker 145 Silly, 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 silly. Volker 145 um, she is doing her own Enderall series. She started after me, but she does much longer live streams of this, so she is way ahead of me. And I've been trying really hard to support her. Um, I can start moving in the direction of where we're supposed to be going while I'm rambling. Uh, by popping in her live streams. But it's really awkward now because she's so far ahead of me. I don't want spoilers. So it's like I pop in and just like try to read the chat. But without paying that much attention to what's actually... Oh, there's one of those dudes. Run, 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 run. What's actually happening in the episode because I don't want spoilers. And I've been able to do it so far. Uh, I've caught a, a really good amount of her live streams. I'm not going to say all of them. But I've definitely caught quite a few of them and just tried to be there and be supportive. Um, Alright, so there's a giant mountain in my way. What is this? Old Ishmartep. I... I don't know that I want to go to... Looks like we can go up that way. Old Ishmartep. We've already detected that, but yeah, I don't really... Old estate of Dalvarek. Okay, we're gonna not go in there for now. I, anytime I come across something, I'm like, ooh, I wanna go in there, and I do. I do, and we will. We will go everywhere. But I want to actually try to focus. <laughs> I know, Teresa, I'm sorry. I we wanna call it my wanderlust, my... Uh, uh, I do not have ADD. I don't. It might seem like it sometimes, but I swear to you, I don't. It's just... Especially here. Well, I guess I do it in every series, but I feel like here, more, more than some other series, because everything is just so new and exciting and beautiful, and I didn't finish talking about regulars. If you are a regular, Okai Rinasai, welcome back. Welcome home. Thank you so much for spending time with me. And I do, I do, I do mean that so, so deeply and profoundly. I don't, I don't know. Probably just comes across cliched and callous and like I'm just, just saying it to say it because I say it quite frequently. But that's, oh, that bird scared the bejesus out of me. And looky, looky what we got over here. A uh, ice claw, which looks like a blue peepee. -pee. Not gonna lie, take a shot. But, uh, yeah. Please go support uh, Vault Girl. She does a bunch of other things besides doing Enderall. I will, I will take the tiniest modicum of credit for getting her into Enderall. Um, we were both doing Frost around the same time, which I, th I think, I think she's done with Frost. She gets things done a lot faster than I do. I am way too uh, anal and right, we've been through here, haven't we? Like a little bit. This looks super familiar. Like I feel like we've been here, but maybe we just didn't go far enough to get to wherever we're going. Because everything's dead. Yeah, we've won. I hopped around Tokyo City like a big playground up here. Look. So yeah, we've definitely been been in here before. So our goal, as always, I like to try to at least complete one quest and explore as much as possible. Alright, so if I've been in here, I love the wildlife. Wildlife is one of my favorite. Um, no, I, was, I thought that was like hanging moss, but uh, old shadow steel mine. No, thank you. That's not what we're looking for. We're so close, and I'm running into a tree. We're so close, yeah, so I, I, I think, I don't know, she, she Volcaro 145 might be almost done with Enderall, which is impressive, because she started way, 
way after me and here here I am episode 45 and I don't even know if I'm a third of the way through a fourth of the way through not not a tenth you know you know what I mean like I have literally and this is clearly as always not how I'm supposed to be getting where I'm getting I don't know how I end up doing this every time I'm trying to go somewhere new but I always end up finding the most ludicrous ways to try to it's totally a dude over there and like most people are hostile in this game so it's probably an enemy come on this is still Skyrim even though it's not Skyrim jumpy jump we can do it we can jump anywhere yeah I believe that's excuse me <coughs> I believe that's the uh, place we're trying to get to right there come on this is when if you ever hear me talk about humping a wall this is this is what I'm referring to come on it's right there all right I might have to <laughs> reevaluate how I'm trying to get here since I'm so close but yet so far I'm sure if I hammered this for another 20 minutes, I'd probably be able to do it, but nobody wants to watch that. So let's try to circle around and find a slightly more reasonable way to get up there. I mean, seriously. Oh, wait, now it's behind me? Well, that was silly. It's been behind me the entire time. All right, let's go all the way up here. This looks like a cool place to get a good view. Good view around. All right, so we got some lions down there. Look at the lions, man. Look at the... I don't even... Like, I almost feel bad. I don't want to say almost. I do feel bad killing them. Now, is there any nests? Because we were doing good finding eggs. It looks like I was supposed to come down there. What's over there? How, how would I have come down that way? Well, all right, got the lion's attention, of course. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, I'm sorry. Please die. Okay. Okay. Luckily, they're no match for my magic. And my god mode. <laughs> Ooh, we're gonna get to do some sexy, sexy mining. Alright, I'm just confused. Where would this... If this looks like the way I would have was supposed to come down here, where where is this? How did I miss this? Oh, spider who wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. I feel like they that's just a frost spider, and they didn't even like make it tan, which is a little weird to me. Because why is it why is it like white? Spit at me, desert spider queen. Oh, Jesus. <coughs> like, I'm not a big spider fan in the first place. It's like nightmare fuel. I've had some pretty crazy, crazy bugs. Our backyard, it's a shared backyard, uh, cause it's a townhouse that we live in, that we, I should say. Look at that, it's a, bag, it's a bag of money. I always leave bags of money just sitting on the ground. I should say we own, we own the townhouse, it's paid. It is paid for, so that's, that's helpful. Um, there's more dudes, or right, are those, oh, those are, um, lost ones. Okay, well, might as well go kill them. Hey, boys. Uh, do I have my frost spell on? Ha! Craw! Are you a sexy lost one? Oh, my god. Oh, I froze four of them at once? All right, well, that was... That was super impressive. Why is my other hand not shooting? What is that? Oh, is that one of those guys? Strategically placed, like, right in the middle, so that way they're in the... That 
I'd have to go really close to him and make him upset. So right behind the townhouse is, is I'd say about 100 yards away, not even 100, 50 yards away. I don't know meters. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know I have a lot of uh, non-English viewers. Non-English, what the hell? Non-American viewers, I don't know why I said English. Um, but I'm not good with the metric system. I'm sorry. Yards and meters are, aren't that different. So, it gives you a, 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 somewhat of an idea. But anyway, uh, wildlife reserve, um, preserve, excuse me. Which basically just means it's a forest. <laughs> um... But there's there's animals back there. Nothing like super crazy. Raccoons, foxes, uh, deer. No bears, thank goodness. My son is like weirdly afraid of bears. <clears throat> I mean, we've we've seen them in zoos and stuff. So I don't know why he's. I mean, he has real life. I'm not trying to mess with you, I swear. I'm gonna I'm run, 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 run. Don't stop running. I ran, I ran, I ran, I ran, I ran, I ran. Alright, I, st I still don't know where... Okay, so there's a road. And if I had just followed the road, this is, this is the road. So, I mean, that's craziness, right? If I had just followed the road like Toucan Sam, then I would have... Alright. I, I don't have a choice. It's not... It's making me get, like, right by you. Alright. Alright. So if you run, you can get past them. And I don't know what... What happened here. I guess they got ambushed by the... The Lost Ones, but there's no... I don't know. Maybe they turned into Lost Ones. Boy, I'm get, rambling about getting to my point. So we get some pretty crazy bugs in here. We get some pretty crazy bugs in here sometimes. And, uh, we normally, like, rock, paper, scissors it <laughs> out for, you know, which one of us kills or slash deals with the various weird bugs that we, uh, got. My son ain't doing any of it. He's out. He's like, this is a bug. He's, he's like, see ya. He could be a gnat. And he, he's like, ah, it's a, he's like, screaming. And I'm like, bro, it's a, it's a gnat. It's an, it's, it's, there's nothing even remotely scary. This is me just being ridiculous. There was a little path. Who knows? There could have been one of those magic symbols. I feel like I'm rewarded for exploring. All right, let's actually get where we're supposed to be going. But yeah, we get some, like, just, some bugs I've never seen before in my life. Woo! Yeah, oh, you know what? I messed up. I messed up. I can't get out. He has to finish. Woo! Yeah. I was supposed to take off his shirt. I forgot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, ladies. Well, not just ladies, necessarily. That was a horrible assumption. Alright, just... Okay. I'm gonna leave the gorilla alone. I don't need to kill the gorilla. Unless he comes at me. Wants to fight. I love... Oh my god, do I love gorillas. My favorite place to go look at gorillas... Is, um... The Philadelphia Zoo. I know some people don't like zoos. Because they're like... You know, like... Like PETA, like... Wait. Did the music change? Am I being attacked? Like, the animals should be free. Let 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 the animals be free. And, like, I, I get it, but... Like, let's be realistic, though, at the same time. Like, we're... We're not... We're, we're being the human race. It doesn't seem like we're, we're in any, uh... I'm seeing things. I thought I saw... What is that over there? Oh, those... Alright, so there's some glitching out over there. I'm not seeing things. There's some glitching out. Thought I saw something weird. Like, we're not slowing down. Breeding and expanding and yada, yada, yada. Yeah, these these plants are wibbly for some reason. Was that a pus beetle I saw? 
Just chilling up there. Did I miss? Yeah. Ha! Boom. Why did he blow up like pieces of wood? I don't think pus beetles are made out of wood. Maybe they are. Learn something new every day. So, I, I don't know. I feel like there's so many creatures that are almost gone as it is. And if we just leave them to their own... I mean, it's a nice thought. It's a nice thought, but I just... I just feel like... Yeah. If we can, if we can, you know... Nobody wants to give them the, the space and the land that they need. So... In many cases, I feel like zoos are the only way to really give them a chance. I don't know. So anyway, I love zoos. And the Philly Zoo is one of my favorite. Alright. We got the key, because we picked that up. That's where we went in, and there was a note and a key, and... We have another note and another key. Completed, proceed to Old Soldiers, solve the puzzles in Old Soldiers. Those who want the treasure must be smart. Mark my words, you can't return once you've started. Oh no. <laughs> oh, solve three tricky riddles in the chambers of this complex and the treasure will be yours. First riddle, eastward incessantly. How is that a riddle? That's two words. <laughs> That's not a riddle. Touch the one who watches the sky. Touch the one who watches the sky. I mean, that at least... Those who proceed without hesitation will find the light. Am I already... Am I already... Locked into this? Am I already locked into this because I came in here? Like... Can I leave? All right. Oh my God. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do, because I, because I'm me and, and I know me. I feel like I'm, I'm fairly self-aware. I know I have a lot of faults, but I, <laughs> I feel like generally I'm self-aware, and I know this might not be my strong suit. Um, I kind of still want to check it out, so we'll drop that safe. <laughs> so that way, if this if this goes horribly. we can revert to that save and just pretend like it never happened. All right, so the first clue was eastward incessantly. So to me, there's doors. And, um, okay. Do I, do I have the key for that? So it's telling me to go east, right? I mean, that, is there any other way to interpret that? All right, now we're in a different place. And we're just going to keep going east. All right, there's nothing. This Is this a hurt me crystal? No, it's not a hurt me crystal. Okay. I don't know how long incessantly will be. I mean, things are changing. I don't know. All right, so it's normally the second door. Still east. Firmament. Okay. So since we're in a different area now, am I supposed to assume, I hate doing that, that we have, that we're done going eastward incessantly? I had no problem saying it like the first eight times I said it. Or am I, oh God. I wish it would, 
would have told me if I'm done. Because if I'm still supposed to be going eastward, okay, things things are upside down. There's there's chests on the ceiling. Because if I'm still supposed to be going eastward incessantly, then I should turn around and go back through the door I just came through. Hmm. What is it called? Magic note or something like that? Magical note. <sighs> Touch the one who watches the sky. See, like I said, I don't know if we're there yet. Touch the one who watches the sky. Here, Vinroot, aka Nernroot in Skyrim. Well, I'll take the Ice Claw. Where is it? Is it up in the air? I can't fly! <laughs> and I can't really see what that is up there. So that's what I'm supposed to be touching. Oh, there's. Oh, it's a red one, too. Um, do I have a scroll for this? I should to unlock uh, expert. I have 11. Ring of elemental expert and all right, so two, we're in a magical area, two rings that are distinctly geared towards magic. Makes sense. Let's put my spell back. I don't know that we're gonna be fighting anything in here, but just in case. So, I mean, is there a way? Is this a jumping puzzle? Are we doing a jumping puzzle now? Is that what's happening? Even if I do a jumping puzzle, how the hell? It doesn't look like any of these are gonna jump me up. Just looking at these glyphs here, these, these, not glyphs, these faces? Is there one that's looking up? Is there one that's looking up? Because they're all kind of like tilted different directions. Is, is this guy supposed to be looking up? He's looking up. Okay, I figured it out, I think. So this would be part two. So then all I have is those who proceed without hesitation will find the light. So it just wants me to go. All right, well, I, don't, I, I guess I'll have to see what go go where where am I going go okay go go where go I don't know where I'm going just go did I go to I don't know which way I'm going all right so we went east 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 to get here so then I would go west 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 to get out Alright, didn't like that. 
right? Because it loaded me back into the same place. Get. All right, yeah. So now I'm doing something wrong. Okay. Um. Pull, 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 pull. All right. So, hold on. Maybe it was just I was just supposed to go. To, I went the wrong way. I was supposed to just go to the other door. Just go. Just go. Run. Faster. The void. Okay. Again, I don't. What the f fudge is this? All right. So the <laughs> uh, okay. So this is we're Indiana Jones now. I just watched the last Crusade last night. So we've been watching it with my son. So all right. I'm just going. Yep. This is 100% in Indiana Jones, The Last Crusade. Alright. Well, before I do that... Wait, what? Set of the Fallen, Mask of the Fallen. Okay. Wall of Frost. Morning Air Potion. Alright. And... This is a different looking magic symbol? Alright, cool. I did good, right? Yay! Yay me! I'm proud of myself. I know, I know it might be hard to believe <laughs> sometimes, especially if you've been watching me play for a long time, but um, I'm supposed to, sup I'm just going to say supposed to be. That way it doesn't sound like I'm being cocky or arrogant. I'm supposed to be smart. Supposed to be. Alright. Okay, hold on. Gonna hide from the oh, mages. Alright. Pop pop. I love how I figured out how to do a pop pop in here. Chunk of cheese. Oh, and you're a cannibal. Alright, where are the mages? Come on. Oh, I missed. Stand still. So I can murder you. Die, you bastard! Alright, he's too strong for me, so. No! That was my friend! Well, I'll then, got you for then maybe he shouldn't attack me. I'm just saying. All right, so, what, Archer? Where? Oh, up, 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 somewhere. I don't see him. What? That's all you got? You, you, you got lost trying to find me. Apparently, I don't know how. <laughs> Pop pop. It's wonderful popping people. I'm taking your bread and wine. Yeah, I'm supposed to be smart. <laughs> Just because you're supposed to be something doesn't mean you are most of the time. I, I always try to tell my son that. Like he he is very smart. They've already um, moved him into some of the advanced things. That exist for third graders, and uh, I've made a point, you know, especially when he does things that are not smart, to say you know, it doesn't mean that you're not smart. Everybody makes mistakes. Sometimes everybody you know, does dumb things, but that you know, it's you learn from them. You just learn not to keep doing whatever you did that was you know dumb or caused a problem or. Or whatever. This area is very interesting. And it looks like they. S All right, we're gonna have to get a closer look when we get down there. 
to the wild mages and the one marauder took out a bunch of I say at least four bodies that I did not kill so that's why we're up here we're looking for cheese wheels but yeah it's okay to make mistakes as long as you learn from them you don't keep doing them and yes yeah, smart people do dumb things all the time which I feel is is true And sometimes people that are really smart in one area are not either they're ignorant or just they just don't have that knowledge base. It happens a lot when people get like really specialized in a, a particular field. You could be like a PhD in chemistry, but like not know. I don't know how to, you know, change the oil in your car or something, something like that. So these are guards. I thought by the outfits that they were gonna be like military dudes. All right, and we got the bad guy music again. Or at least I thought we had the bad guy music again, but I had no red blips. So I do not want to sit at the table. I want the food. But this is fake food. It's it's it's. I can search the coconuts, which I will always and forever search coconuts. Because who doesn't love some coconuts besides my wife and my son? <laughs> Neither one of them likes coconut. This episode is also, uh, on that note, going to be a day late. This will be uploaded on Friday with, well, not with, but. On the same day that um, if the Skyrim modded series gets uploaded, if you haven't checked out if, I I don't know how to persuade people to check it out. It's a really really fun series. It's Skyrim with with a bunch of mods. Um, the three main ones are what what the uh, series is named after. So it's interesting NPCs. Which basically just adds in a ton of very, very good voice acted. Um, with tons of dialogue and tons of story NPCs in various places that you can interact with. And uh, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Um, immersive is immersive world encounters. Which basically just adds all kinds of fun things. Uh, besides the like the the random the, the, the gene, generic and I can't say the word generic the generic random encounters that occur um, and it's uh, something that I can adjust the frequency so I'm actually gonna bump it up and make it so that way those types of things happen more often so somebody came in and killed all the guards and we can apparently go into the terminal hall but we don't have any reason to do that yet so not sure that I want to do that necessarily let's take a quick look at the quests again we've completed a quest which is always at least one of my things that I like to try to do every episode Alright, Maxis Tabacus, which is still just absolutely hilarious, told me an obtruse story. He searches for somebody who can... Uh, okay, so this is the... We had found Aurora. Lek Lurk, which sounds like Lake Lurk. We had found Aurora, and I said we were going to go to her, and now I don't remember where she is. Hold on. <laughs> she was... She was at the old lighthouse or something right somewhere in that general vicinity so if I just head south I mean there is supposed to be a road is this the road yeah I think this might be the road maybe I'll try to follow the road for once instead of off road in it like I like I uh, generally do yeah it's this headed south so theoretically what is this bottle of wine okay thanks 
new subscribers. We do have Optimus Gnarl, Peter Verratti. No idea what series you gentlemen are watching. Again, I said gentlemen again. I don't know why I always say why I always go to gentlemen. Because I did have, it was it was it was a bunch of dudes for a while. It was like it was Jeff, Matthew, Nathan, Mark, John, um, and Peter. Again, probably a dude. I do know a female Peter, so not necessarily. So <laughs> you find people. Uh, not sure which series you find pathless, which series you're watching. But if it happens to be this one, thank you so very much. Old Aska Man. Okay. Again, I as soon as I see that, I want to go in. I want to explore everything. But I'm trying to actually do... Alright, which way am I going here? It doesn't look like I have a choice. South... South... Easty? So this one? Right? Yeah, that looks like I'm staying on the road. And we'll run to try to speed this up. I mean, if I've already been through here, which I can't remember if I have or not, then uh, we shouldn't really encounter too much of anything hostile. Alright, the lighthouse already popped up on the map, so we're making some good progression here. I believe that's where Aurora was. Of course, the lighthouse did did move. I have to kind of go more south. I heard. I heard. Is that you? I heard. I thought I heard flies. Well, that was a lot of scrolls. Okay. I, so focus on getting from point A to point B. I almost missed this whole little area here. Okay. Can you please stop getting stuck on rocks? Alright, is this where we're going? For the most part, yes. I'm gonna wanna go to the lighthouse. I believe that's where she was. So which way would be again straight <laughs> straight is straight is where I, uh, it looks like there's a road here too where where is this road I'm just gonna go up the mountain S screw it she'll be coming around okay or not okay so not <sighs> I mean, it totally looked like there was a road there. Is this the road? You can do it! Yeah, I, like I started to say, I'm a day late um, uploading this. I've never been more than a day late, but I always feel even feel guilty just being a day late, but uh, my wife had surgery yesterday. One of the things that I didn't, you know, haven't really been talking about pretty open about talking about pretty much anything but haven't really gone into that in too much detail and I still won't other than to say that she had the surgery and the surgery went well she is uh, resting yes I'm taking his shirt off relax woo yeah look at them glutes you can see you can see the curve of that glute, even though uh, that dirty cloth is covering my bum hole. Uh, why is my legs? Why are there part of my legs missing? You see that? That was weird. I don't know why part of my legs are missing. Weird and distracting. All right, let's go talk to Aurora. Aurora Borealis. Yeah, she was living with a. Oh, did I mix it up? Is this not where she is? Oh no, it's not. Damn it, where was she then? Hold on. Uh. Okay, it was in between here and here. So I guess something that's not coming up. 
Yeah, because the hollow hand, we 100% went in and killed everybody. Out of curiosity, I'm kind of wondering if that's still empty or not. Since we went in here and killed everyone, we can take a quick peek. Uh, we also have Gemini Storm. Yeah, everybody's still dead. And apparently I left an arrow. That's weird. Again, are we, is this the fighting music? The, the, the one song keeps making me think it's fighting music. And then there's still that weird breathing that makes it sound like there's some sort of something in here and there's not or I'm leaving I, this place creeps me out uh, Gemini Storm is watching Project Valkyrie which which I've mentioned a couple times recently is, is pretty much my most popular series um, episode one of that series has a couple thousand views which is I mean if I do like 30 views <laughs> that's that's a lot for me and that's okay it's okay still this is fun I, I I would like subscribers for sure yeah this is the building that she was in uh, and the last one I will talk about is Jamie Gill now, Jamie Gill had posted a word I'm not gonna say the word I am gonna mention this at least once in every series and the word I googled in the past because I didn't know what it was when some Russian accounts had posted it to me and it's basically it's like a website where you can go and buy wait where the hell is she now she's up upstairs upstairs subscribers and thank you no thank you I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna buy subscribers I, I very much would like a thousand but um, yeah I'm not she's got a lot of hookahs mm -hmm. Who are you? What's up? How did you get in? All right, she seems. She that's hanging moss, but I can't uh, harvest it. I killed the troll down there, or whatever that thing was, and um, I'm here to talk to you. Mm hmm. Who are you? How Odin did Sun. you get in? My name is Odin, son. There was a bone ripper. That's what it was in your living room. I killed it. Why well, have a feeling she's gonna be upset about that? A bone ripper. Oh, that's... that's bad. Oh, blazes. And here I thought that the barrier spell Tarhuti sold me Tarhuti. would actually do its job. Anyway, who are you? And what do you want here? I want to know how you get your hair so blue. It's very vibrant. So you really are Tarhuti's sister, aren't you? I ran an errand for her back in Riverville. <laughs> My condolences. Sounds like you are on good terms. Huh? Oh, no, we get along just fine. It's just... She's a fraud. She sells rubbish to superstitious farmers, old skulls and love potions, and promises they'll solve all their problems. I always tell her to get a real job, but she won't listen. Either way, back to the topic at hand. What do you want? I still have that master skull, and I don't remember what I'm supposed to do with it. I'm supposed to go somewhere and dance with it or <laughs> something. I can't remember. I want to get in contact with someone deceased and I was told that you could help me. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes, I can help. Or let me put it this way. The voices of the new age can. Voices of the new age? That sounds like a um, like an alt-rock band. Yes. Now. Don't take this the wrong way, but you don't look very spiritual to me, so I won't waste my time with explanations. What's important is that the seances I perform are complicated, which is why I'll need something from you to do them. Show Cuthbert's bristles right, so I was told, will this do the trick? What's that, hair? <laughs> oh, you read one fairy tale too many, haven't you, kid? <laughs> I don't need a lock of hair. I need a... Um, potion. 
a special concoction that facilitates the process of getting in touch with the dead. Yeah, no, she wants me to get her something to get drunk or high or something like that. I, I, I could tell already. What kind of potion? As I said, a special one. Here, this is a list of the ingredients. Find them and have some alchemist brew the potion, then come back to me. Ah, and one more thing. You said the Bone Ripper broke the door? It did. You don't think you could do an old woman a favor and uh, repair the door for me? I can't hold a seance if a group of lost ones could just saunter into the tower at any moment. Sure, whatever you need. Oh, thank you, dear. You're a treasure. Okay, so now I'm a door repairman? Okay. You said you're an old woman. Mm -hmm. Are you an old woman? I can't even, I can't even really see. Your face. You don't look at me when I'm talking to you. Look at me. Look at me when I'm... Alright. She looks older, mm -hmm. but not like old. Hmm. Need something? My sir? My dude? So anyway, please subscribe. <laughs> if you had it. Alright, what what are we getting here? What, what does she want? She gave me a blueprint for her door. What in the world am I getting? Recipe for the potion of cosmic winds. So I have all these. I have to sell these in between episodes. All right. Um, yes, yes, yes. I was just checking. Elixir Two batches of pea weed. One glass of king Two mead. Of one speed. jug of banana liquor. I Preparation. Give the ingredients into a pot Perfect. and heat them evenly. Well, Afterwards, fill them water. into a bottle. Well, let's see. Okay. Did she have a... What did that say? Repair front door, formerly. Need to get a new door before... <laughs> well, I kind of figured that, thanks. Did she have... She doesn't have any crafting stations or anything. Okay. We already stole everything from her while she's up there. Smoking her pea weed. Okay. Um. Well, we need to go back to Ark anyway. The waterfall, waterfall is loud. So let's. I guess let's go back to Ark. I need another teleport to Ark spell. I have to make sure I pick that up before we leave. I will probably forget. Talk about the Skyrim If series, there is also a bunch of surprises. Like I said, those are the main three mods, which I didn't even finish doing. I did um, interesting, immersive, and the whole first chunk of that series is the Forgotten City, which was the mod maker was. Hear my words, oh. I'm sorry, we're gonna pause. I think we just had an earthquake. All right, uh, yeah. And we're back. The, <laughs> the, yeah, the, the whew. We had an earthquake, and uh, we are not, we don't get earthquakes? I'm, uh, I'm not a young man. I'm not an old man, but I'm not a young man. Uh, by any stretch of the imagination either and uh, that would be the first time I've ever experienced an earthquake apparently it wasn't that big it was a 
4.8, but it, uh, especially considering I've never experienced it before, was definitely quite scary. I apologize uh, for that. Uh, my wife uh, had come downstairs and she said apparently she dropped an F-bomb, so I don't know if we uh, <laughs> picked that up. I'm not super concerned, even if we did. Uh, we are back in uh, Ark. We are turning in the ingredient. Hungry, Hungry for Ark. Ah, when does the I golden sickle open? I don't want to break in. It's 9, 10 in the morning. Some shifts never end. I know. <sighs> they just sit on their asses and hope things settle themselves. Idiots. Seriously. What My is, sir? What is going on? I just, I just want to go into the golden sickle and give them the stuff. So yeah, it's wild. Uh, if any of you have been through an earthquake, maybe you can share with me uh, your experience. Because I didn't know what the heck was going on. I mean, I guess if you live in a place that normally has earthquakes, it's not a big deal. And you, you, I don't know if you ever really get used to it, but like you, you at least know what's happening. Like I was like, are we under attack? <laughs> are we, um, I thought explosion. It might sound weird. Like, why would I think explosion? I thought explosion because we, we had an explosion, um, back in, I think it was 94, close to my house that shook the house um and this was the feeling was similar except this was a much longer they feel like it went like 10 15 seconds oh my god with the golden sickle not being open when does it open here do i have anything in the smelt <clears throat> glowing thorium ingot okay This is exciting. Well, there uh, comes a point when you just have to live with it. Well, there uh, comes a point where you just have to live with it. Looks like it cracked the floor, as far as I could tell, in the basement. So that's, uh, that's super exciting, too. And by super exciting, I mean not exciting at all. We don't, we don't need any more help with any other things that are going <laughs> to... Cost money. From All right, I, I, I don't know. Like, is, is the gold? Is it? It's Friday. It's 9:30 a.m. When does the golden sickle open? Oh my god. Um, I'm just trying to waste time until it decides to actually open up. I don't, I don't, I don't use any weapons, so there's not really any point in me uh, upgrading any of them. Run, chicken, run! Let's chase the chicken. Mm. Yeah, mm. what's up, chicken? <clears throat> oh, I think I stepped on the chicken. Um, hey, Grandma Sparkles, what are you doing? All right, I tried to talk to her. She, she rather <clears throat> some tenor. What about you, Golden Ford? Oh, hello! I haven't, I haven't seen, seen you around, around here before. before. Just, uh, just take, take a look, look around and, and tell me if you see anything you like. How was that? Was that good? Uh, show me what you got in stock. Oh, a bit of this and mm, that. Uh, feel, feel free, free to, to take a look. look. Alright, what do we got? I, I could try to make the door. Potions, I could try to make the door. The That's something I could do. Walk blessed. Walk blessed. I didn't think about making the door. Because that's not a normal thing I would do. Um, do I even know how to make a door? Where where am I doing that? At? Here? <laughs> Solid door. I need... Wood. Okay. It's gonna sound like a really dumb question. Where do I get wood from? Sir, by chopping wood, of course. Woo! 
Yeah, sexy, Some sexy. Some shifts never end. You said that already. Sexy, sexy wood chopping. Well, at least we can see the Leoran in the background there, munching away. Munch, munch, munch. Munch, munch, Walk munch. Blast. Walk blast. Walk blast. My sir. My <clears> dude. <throat> my damn. This is so boring. Oh my god. Woo! Yeah. This is worse than mining. Can we can we do can we can we not stop until we have enough wood, please? Thank you. Kind sir. Oh hear me, path abiding citizens. Hungry for arcane secrets? I have books, scrolls, potions, anything for friends of path abiding magic. Yep, path abiding magic. Alright, that should be enough wood. I think he's gonna do one more, so what did he do? Six each time? And choppy choppy. Okay. Well, I'm very curious to <coughs> listen back into this episode and see if you can hear the earthquake. All right, solid door. So we're at least uh, accomplishing something. Hooray, we made a door. Oh, there's the smooth jam coming in. Yeah, uh huh. Here comes the Brewster. Oh yeah. <laughs> Why is it? What are you doing, flips over here? Why is it still not open? Seriously, what is going on? I don't understand. Hear yeah. my words, it's not as if I didn't tell them that already. Uh, uh, I don't know what to do. Hungry for arcane secrets? I have books, scrolls, potions, anything for friends of path abiding magic. There's too many people here. So we always go too easy on this guy. Hear my words. Oh, hear my words. Huh? Can I help you? Only the weak of pathless spirits are prone to the workings right, of this red I, madness. I don't, I don't know what to do. Should I just? Why would? Why was it saying apprentice like I had to pick the lock to get in when? <sighs> Sorry about that. What blessed, my sir? Hey, what's up? I haven't seen you for a while. How you? What are you doing here? Now look at that. If it isn't my new friend, what brings you here? Have you also been granted an audience by the most pleasant living person in the civilized world? You're talking about Dal Loran, I take it? More errands. There has been a disquieting development, let's put it that way. Um... Well, certainly not the fabled king of old Aranath. But yes, after three days of keeping me waiting, the great Deloran has finally deigned to see me. I suppose I should feel honored. What brings you here? More errands? I'm just gonna say more errands. I feel for you. Nice to see, however, that your travels have brought you into warmer regions of this country, too. I miss the sun and beaches of Kilay. I really do. Uh, how do you know I've been to the east? We all have our secrets, don't we? Are you watching me? Now, off you go to your master. I've heard he doesn't like his pets to keep him waiting. Well, bless it, my sir. Why are you all up on my grill? Where are we going? Which which door is it? Is it this? No. Where is he? Sir? Is he upstairs? Is there another upstairs? Hmm? Well, bless it, my sir. I, okay. Hmm? I, I don't know where I'm going. No. Oh, there isn't. <laughs> <laughs> it's been so long since I've been in here. What's up? Apparently she thinks I'm your your errand boy. I don't know. Yes? I found the ingredients. I don't even remember what these ingredients are for. It's been so long. Wonderful. I've not been idle in the meantime either. Another protector provided me with some information on this Dijon. And as little as I like to say this, the odds that the Kaleans really are behind the ambush 
Get more likely by the minute. That's bad, so what's the next step? As I said, we need to be sure. First, we need to wait for the report from the Apothecarius. Then... You miserable, two-faced bastard! Don't you have any respect? I could ask you the same thing. Oh. I... Have I heard correctly that you seriously believe we had something to do with the ambush on your caravan? What I believe is that there have been a series of peculiar coincidences, which we are investigating. No more, no less. Peculiar coincidences. I see. <laughs> as peculiar as the fact that you coincidentally forgot to inform us that the Scarabaeus has been stolen by a bunch of bandits? Leave. Now. The Blue Islands Coalition will learn of this accusation. Be sure of that. And you. You are no better. Bloody liars, all of you. What the F did I do? Irreverent Wint. How did she know? Do you still think the Galeans are really behind the ambush? Uh, Onaleus uh, seemed offended by the implication. Uh, bu -bu -bu. She must have eavesdropped. Kaleans like to do that. How does the saying go? Those who've lost the path shout the loudest. If there were nothing to our assumptions, she would have stayed calm. But still, we need to know for certain. Uh, how do you think the Blue Islands Coalition will react to this? The question is when. I assume Onalus will contact them by letter. But even if she hires a myriad courier to carry it, it will be days until the Calayans get it. Until then, we won't know for sure. Here's your pay. You will hear from me once there's news. Okay. Why? <laughs> Why is everybody teleporting around? I'm gonna cut you off. I wanted to talk to her in her tight pants. Where'd she go? Is she gonna be outside waiting for me? Give me a piece of her mind? No. That's disappointing. Hmm? Okay. Oh my god, I love this holy city. Apples, dates, It's not as if I didn't tell them that already. No, there's so many, so many places. Oh my god. Seek. Of honor this come and take Hodor a good long feet. The name disciples of the Right. Too many people talking. Um I just wanted to look and see. Like we've been to the nobles quarter quite a few times. I know there's places that we still haven't even been to in here. But I think we've been to every building that we can go in here. Like we haven't been able to get in the Purim's hut. So I'm like, have we been to the foreign have, quarter? In an act of limitless cowardice, attempted to storm the palace of the Golden Queen. Scrolls, potions, By that, the they have not only magic. defiled the grandeur of the- The area is just, there's too much going on there. <laughs> it's just, it's, I mean, I, it's, is it a uh, replicating a busy city? Yes, it's, but it's, it's, it's a lot. All right, so I'm going to take a look at the map here and see. Like, have I been in the Dancing Nomad? Screws, hats, odds, and ends. Um, all right, yeah, there's definitely been some places I haven't been here. There's a lot. Oh, these are all gatehouses. 
I was like, there's a lot of... Alright, so... I can't remember if we've been in the Dancing Nomad. I think we have. Yeah, because that's where we met, um... This is where we had that conversation with, with her, isn't it? Tight pants that just got angry at us. Was all this stuff You're making a mess? You dropped the mushroom on the ground, buddy. Oh, yes, Bar. What's up? Never walked back on the road from the aged man's abode. Huh? You got around quite a bit before you came back here, didn't you? What are your thoughts on the current events? <laughs> yeah, I did. Why do you ask? Because right, it was an option of dialogue. What made you come back to Enderal? What's it like traveling as Mercy? What countries have you been to? Um, I feel like we asked them all that already, haven't we? Keep your chin up. Okay. Kind of bummed he only has Mead! Like, stew! Roast pork! Like generic Anyone? dialogue. Oh, okay. Um, trying not to get too close of a look at the ladies' hoo-hahs. Her wibble jibbles. Jiggly bits. I'd say that's one of the funniest things when I'm looking for mods and things to put on is just the amount <clears throat> of uh, adult <laughs> oriented things and I'm just like okay I don't know I have like like a thing like I I, I like adult things I like games I don't necessarily want those two things blended together well uh, comes a point all right let's check the map so that's the loud bread girl, isn't it? And, and we, we just have, have to live with it. Melt away in rapture as a crunchy loaf of bread. One. Oh my god! From my hands into yours. Oh no! Run, run from the bread girl. Did that get me where I wanted to go? Uh, kind of. Sc Screw hats, odds, and ends. Have we ever been in here? All right, we'll hit that. That's not the right place, but I don't think we've been in here either. What do we have here? He has uh, some chickens in his house. What's up, uh, Me Megar Ironford? Walk blessed. It's good to see you. Okay, you don't. Isn't this a shop? What? What did I just say? Did that just... Did that just say... That I, that I committed a crime? What crime did I commit? What? What? Time out. What? What crime did I just commit? Hmm? For... Why... Why is... I don't understand. Why is talking to him... Committing a crime? What, what the... We're not having that. No. Alright. I don't... I don't understand, so we're just going to turn right around and leave. Because <laughs> apparently, talking to that man is a crime. I guess maybe it's because I'm trespassing, but like I didn't, I thought it was a shop. Alright, let's make sure I don't have a bounty. Okay. Ironford's metalworking. Which, to me, implies that it's a shop. Okay, but apparently it's not a shop. Alright, that's... A stairs to nothing. Where in the world 
is this? Here it is. Am I gonna get? Am I gonna get a? Is it gonna give me a? Say I'm trespassing for trying to buy things in this shop. Walk blessed. What do you have in stock? Why are you walking away from me? This and that. Uh, just take a look. Okay. Bunch of potions. I need. Um. I don't know. I'll buy two. I don't remember how many of these I have. What else you got? All right. Safe travels. I mean, so that worked out from the perspective that I needed some arc things, but there was one other shop list list shop lifting shop listed. <laughs> Screw yeah, where the heck is screws? Why why can't I not find this place? Bread. Taste it now. Is this it? Screws, hats, odds and ends incorporated. This looks like somebody's house. Nope. <laughs> Why does it sound like a shop and then I go in and it's somebody's house? Is this is this the shop? Which one's actually the shop? Alright, this looks like a shop. Hello, Accountant Tiwan. You don't know this. Hmm. How can I explain? Um, <gasps> and screws, hats, odds and ends is... Ah. And did I forget to mention that we are the number one supplier of the Holy Order in terms of metalware and starling technology? Alright, so we have talked to him, and it's not a shop. So... Does anybody... Need anything done? I guess not. Okay, now I'm in, like the bedroom. Nope. 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 I don't want to get in trouble for trespassing. So let's just leave. Alright, I feel like there's still things that we've missed in the city. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? <sighs> Everybody's so bored. <coughs> Who killed the chicken? I'll take its meat. I didn't kill it. Don't blame me. So, on the bright side, as we were, so ran past mm -hmm. that chest in the rim, I have. I just don't see the fucking coin. Figured out how to teleport. <laughs> Finally. We always go And to. I've also figured out how to use my chest correctly. I, I have eliminated my confusion about that. The rim is going quite well. I'm enjoying it a lot. Like I said, there were some crazy things that happened in the previous episode, but... Uh, Hear my words, oh, oh path-abiding no. people of this holy city. Why are you a so miracle loud? has happened. A miracle that must have been due to its sheer glory. What are we going to do now? All right. Are we making enough same thing in the Nobles Quarter. I feel like we've been to most of the places here. All the shops I've definitely been in. We've been to the library. So what's happening is I'm, I'm, I'm having a think think. I'm having a memory that's saying, hey, there's a place in here you haven't been to. Maybe it's the theater? Maybe it's the theater. Or the House of Actors. I'm not sure. There's a place, I believe, somewhere in here I have, I have not been to. And that there may be a quest. Okay. Never mind. I need a key to get in there. So if that's one of the places, that doesn't work. And the House of Actors is down this way. 
Everybody's so, Greetings! Everybody's so tired. Is this the House of Actors? This is the House of Actors. I've definitely not been in here. I'm like 99% sure it was Mrs. Foyce, too, was the one that had told me. All right, can I... Oh, um, you're an outlander, aren't you? From Kilei. Your skin, it looks, um, different. That's, um... <laughs> uh, uh, all right, I feel like we've had this conversation before. Is that supposed to be her nipple? We're just going to pretend that's a mole. Because if that's her nipple, it's very high on her chest. Um, my mother does, yes, I grew up, so we've, we've said these before. Naram, you say? Huh. But still, your mother must have told you a lot about her homeland, didn't she? Say, is it true that on Kile, even the door handles of the slum houses are coated with gold? I've heard the Blue Islands Coalition is so rich that they can afford to command a mercenary army large enough to fight an army of seraphs. Yeah, we've, we've done this before. Okay. Farewell. I don't remember talking to her before. And she's the only one here to talk to. I really want to knock these over, but apparently they are so expertly stacked you cannot knock them over. Walk blessed. Thank, thanks. Okay, so Mrs. Voice and or Lewin or whoever it was that had... Uh, Give me the heads up about there being another quest to pick up somewhere in here. <sighs> or I'm just nice. misremembering, which is also possible. Between <sighs> cobbles Please let me and know. excretion. <clears throat> and I will Between uh, darkness and light. Try to find it. Like I said, I've been in the library, because that's where I went to find out more about the Butcher Bark. Malthus blessings, Monsieur. Are you looking for something to read? Yeah, I want you name it, I got it. All right, I don't believe that. I think I have all the books, except for the Butcher of Ark stuff. Yeah, we and we hopped all around in here. Looking for stuff. So if there is if there is a butcher of arc book in here, we uh, couldn't find it because I one hundred percent went in, like went upstairs, and I think he even had like a chest or something up there, and I believe I unlocked it and everything. do a lot of cooking. I don't really know that there is a reason for me to do cooking other than oh, well that, that what did I do? Run out of salt? So I made some garlic bread and that was it. I was done. <laughs> oh god. Yeah because he had, we had, I figured out how to get into that area over there even though it's locked off. Thought maybe he might have some contraband over there. But, uh, not that we could find. He's got a very nice violin that I can't steal. But yeah, I'm pretty sure we checked the chest. Nothing worth, uh, stealing. Yeah, so I have... Butcher of Arc, one, two, three, four, five, and then nine. Him of the Desert King. Dark as the sun, light. As Run the away from the waterfalls. Run. Run. They're so loud. Run. All right, let's take a quick look. Um, uh, procure her and install the front door. So, I mean, we can go back and give her her front door. Brew a potion. Cosmic winds. Alright, so we had looked at that. Biggest egg hunt. We've been slowly doing that. Art of combat.
We haven't done this yet, which just reminds me so much of... I literally just did this quest with my son, the one in uh, Skyrim where you you um, poison the mead so that way Maven Blackbriar can take over the, the Honing Brew meadery. Still a little confused about these, but apparently, like, you're just supposed to find them? I did, I did actually look this up and I didn't read it, so like, I looked it up and I bookmarked it so that way I could go in and read it. Because I read something about the Ash Widow and apparently the Ash Widow is some place I've already been, but I'm supposed to go there with something or with something on or I don't remember exactly. We could go back and finish this. I kind of am interested in that. Oh, bounty missions. Um, Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back to Duneville. We're going to put on Aurora's door. We are going to... There is um, bounties in... Duneville as well. And it was suggested... I think Volcaro was the one that suggested this to do the bounties there. So let's go ahead and... Teleport back to Duneville. <clears throat> See ya. Boom shakalaka. And then I float. Uh, I'm the little mermaid. And poof. This episode is not sponsored by earthquakes or... <laughs> Dear God, if, I, if I'm off this episode, you know why. Earthquakes or Mountain Dew Major Melon Zero. It's better than the regular Major Melon. It's a watermelon flavored Mountain Dew. Not super fond of the regular version. The watermelon, the fake watermelon flavor is just too strong. Pity. He was a good man. He was a good man. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where the bounty board is. Is it inside? actually inside Duneville. I guess that would make sense rather than being in the uh, atrium or the outside area or whatever you want to call that. Okay. But once we get in here, dudes start hawking and spitting and all kinds of things. What happens if we go back into Mania's house? There's just just nothing. Alright. I was just curious. I mean, I could take her poop bucket, but I'll leave it for her. That way she doesn't have to poop in her hands. Alright. Bounty board. Bounty board, where are you? The spitting guys, do you know where the bounty board is? Maybe by the... Maybe uh, over here by the... Uh, uh, oh god. So the shift dragged on forever. And he strayed in the void As the wayward wanderer Despising Hey, the want something to drink? It was no. men just... Uh, bounty missions and petitions are announced on this notice board. Search for a bounty quest. Sure. For him. Wanted in Duneville. Wanted is a woman named Grave Sister Sita who is said to be under the influence of the Red Madness. She was the former graveyard keeper in Duneville Vault. <laughs> whose behavior changed drastically in the last few moons. She is accused of desecration of corpses in multiple cases and murder of a minor. There's a 300 penny bounty for her head. Yet the dreams that he saw take more than one in the time? deep red of the glow. Okay, so kill. This is just a straight up find and kill person. I can, I can handle it. This is my speed. All right, we're we're on it. Where where are we going? All right, it's somewhere. Before. I'm just Go to luck. trying he to get away from all of you. You're also loud. And find find my diploma. I'm looking for your diploma. I have to. She making me do menial tasks like repair her door and give her a potion. What do you want from me? All right, where, where, where? I'm like, did it tell me to leave and then they immediately come back in? No. It wants me to go. Move along. I am moving along. I'm literally running. 
can't go any faster. This isn't oblivion. Okay, where am I going though? There's a giant mountain in my way. Seriously. Doomville's crypt. It, we're, it's another one of these things where we're like, we're so close, but also not. All right, so this not this way. It's not this way. Please keep running. No, Malvis, that's you're pointing the wrong way. It's not that way. It's it's. I have to go. I guess around back this way, up and around. Up, up, up and down, turn, turn, turn around, round, round, round about and over again. Gun, gun, son of gun, you are the only one makes any difference what I say. Please don't unsubscribe. Thank you. If you nail that song, I'll be surprised. But you can name it. Alright, so this is like literally right above. Doonville. So we could have fell down like in that way. Please, please let me get over this mountain. Thank you. Where is, <laughs> where is this crypt? I feel like I'm further away now than I was before. Oh my god. It's over here, right? We, we, we saw this, I think, last episode, as a matter of fact. We just didn't go in. So let's go in and murder... Who we were murdering? I forgot who it was already. Sita. We're going, we'll murder Sita. We, didn't we even go in here? I think we already even went in here. Yeah, we 100% we went in here already. So, theoretically, yeah, because look, we killed everything. So it's just gonna be her. Apparently she's also tired. Everybody's tired? Hey, what's up? Okay. Oh no. <laughs> well that's what happens when I don't put my spells back on. So remember kids, always put your spells back on, otherwise you end up trying to teleport in the middle of a fight. And uh, yeah, I'd already, I'd actually already searched the chest and everything, which is kind of funny that I've already been here. And did all this for the most part. All right, cool. That was that couldn't have been any easier. I tried talking to her. I don't know why. I thought maybe she'd want to have a conversation. She was just she was chill at first, but nope. She just wanted to die. So now it's like I could I could teleport back to Doomba, but it's right there. So, again, we have to run, go to the bounty board, I guess, turn in the bounty, grab another bounty. Wait, where is this telling me to go now? Where is it telling me to go? Receive the bounty. Okay. Where is it? I'm confused. Over here? Who am I? What? Why? Oh, that's a sneaky way to get back into Duneville. Oh, this is cool.
All right, that works. Yeah, I forgot that there's all those like weird little exits and entrances. All right, how? What's the fact? Can I get it? Can I cheat? Is there a faster way for me to get over here? Yes. Level. <gasps> this request refers to the termination of a grotesque lost one which is making trouble on the strands of Enderal's east coast. More than a thank, thank you. More than a half a dozen <laughs> plantation workers were killed by this creature, hence it was named the Manhunter. The bounty is four hundred pennies. Oh, sure. Alright, what's the fastest way for me to get out of here? Keep your fingers to yourself, will you? This isn't us. Listen, I'm not fingering you, Jesus. This is a PG-13 stream. Stream. <laughs> Talk about streaming. Uh, oh, where is this saying to go now? Why do they keep wanting me to go behind where I am? All right, that's all the way down there. Okay. All right, we know how to do that. I am still considering streaming. If I stream something, it will probably be something that I'm not doing a series for. It will probably be something just for funsies. Just something different. I have several other things that I want to play. Um, like why are we not jumping? And that would be a fun way for me to actually be able to do it and not, you know, start a whole series for it. So it would be things like, I'll give an example. I'll, I'll give an example of one I don't want to stream. I don't want to stream uh, Outer Worlds because I have the Spacer's Choice and I got it for free. Not because I'm special or anything, just because uh, Epic Games gave it away for free. I think it was around Christmas time or something like that. They normally do some pretty great giveaways uh, then. But anyway, it's, the Spacer's Choice, it's like the Game of the Year version. It's, it's the version with all of the DLC and everything. So I have that for the PC. So I've only played uh, Outer Worlds on the... Uh, I'm trying to get out of the water on the PlayStation. So, you know, PC means mods and things like that. So very interested in doing that and checking it out. So I don't want to do a stream for that because I'd like to do that as a series someday. All right, where, where are we going? We're still, we still have quite the ways to go. Okay. So basically right back down by where that ship was that we, where we, where we met Darius. So past uh, this place again. And again, I'm hitting jump. Why are we not jumping? But I do have a bunch of other games that, like, if, if I did a stream for just a couple hours just for fun. Excuse me. Uh, I'm still not saying I still I might like fall like games I'm not as familiar with, but I still might like fall in love with it and want to do the series. But at least. I wouldn't. Well, since we're gonna run right past here, I might might as well put her door in while I'm here. All right, here's. <laughs> Why is she laughing like that? What is happening? You just up here giggling? Mm -hmm. Can you brew me a potion? <laughs> Easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> what do you need? I don't I don't know. I didn't know that was an option. Okay, so she's a shop. Okay. That's cool. So like what if I I kinda hate wasting money, but I have a lot of money. So what if I bought all of the Duneville scrolls? So that way if I'm gonna keep doing these bounties, I can just use the scrolls to fast travel back and forth. 
Alright, so she has... Do you happen to have any of those eggs that I need? I don't remember the names of the eggs. Doesn't look like it. Looks like you just have the, the, the basic eggs, not the special eggs. Don't want a spider egg, thank you. No, okay. I don't remember the names of them, but it wasn't spider egg or chicken egg. Or fish eggs. Or, or just generic bird egg. Right? Let me check real quick. I hit the right buttons. Leaf goals, peak dasher, and fire finches. Alright, let's go put her door in. I don't know why she was up there giggling like that. I thought something was going on. I guess she was just having a laugh. Alright, let's fix her door. Ooh, we got a whole fade out and everything for fixing the door. Alright, cool. There you go. Alright, let's go kill... Oh, it's a giant. Oh my god, it's a giant. They made a giant into a lost one. Oh my god. Um, he's not going to come into the water, right? Oh, he saw me. Alright, well that's... Alright, well that was... I'm just too strong for my own good. Bloodstained Warhammer. Yeah, that was... That was kind of silly. That was kind of... I almost feel bad. <laughs> that was kind of silly. Alright, so now that I have all those Doomville... Scrolls... Let's do our wibbly jibbly... Load in bits. And this is faster than me running back, but I also kind of wish it didn't do the animation every time. I don't know. That's just a nitpicky thing. It's a cool animation, don't get me wrong, but it's going to get tiresome after I've done it for like the 500th time. Alright. And the, I don't know why I have to fall down every time. Makes me feel like I'm not very good at teleporting if I just fall every time I teleport. Alright, let's go back to the really noisy tavern. And turn... Bro! Bro. Bro. How are you doing that? An outlander. Isn't this nice? What if I sit in the chair? Oh, okay. So it thinks he's sitting in the chair. But he's definitely not sitting in the chair. <laughs> All right. forever. Huh? Just make no trouble. Alone in the dark. Our lives will be lacking the bounty missions petition to search for bounty quests yes please this request asks the elimination of a wild myrad oh which attacked and destroyed some supply ships the last few moons the population thinks it's a is it is the reincarnation of a legendary predator named gar garak uh, fulfilling this contract, only 500 pennies. I feel like that one should be more. In a bed. Sorry. What's up? How are you? Huh? How are you doing? Ah, sure thing. See now, I think would that have been? Yeah. So if you got rid of her, then you wouldn't be able to use her as a shop. So, I mean, that might be. That's interesting. That might be... I'm gonna buy this. That might be one of the main reasons to not implicate her. Kind of a shellfish re... Shellfish? Yeah, shellfish or... Shellfish or... I don't know. Selfish? 
reason, but still, I didn't make that choice. Ah, it's you. Told you it was Darius, didn't I? Good work. Without you, we'd still be out there. Alright, now you're telling me good work. Last time I went by, you talked about keeping my fingers out of your stuff and things. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, I. I did. I'm. Well, still discombobulate. We're gonna wrap this episode up. Let's take a look and see where we're going, though. Like literally, <laughs> literally right back where we just were. Oh my god! All right, all right, we're gonna. <laughs> yeah, definitely, definitely have to be done at this point. Um, we're close to being done time-wise. I'm all thrown off, but we'll go deal with this Myrad. I'm not. Super excited about killing my rad, but hopefully it's like a really ugly, you know, like mean one or something. So we'll do an yet another swim swim. At least this one isn't as far as the previous one. It looks like it's just gonna be like right over here in this general location. But as soon as I can get out of the water. We'll get out, run over there. I don't even know how I'm gonna kill a Myrad. I mean, if it's on the ground, I guess I could freeze it and pop pop it before it uh, takes off. But if it's flying around, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Weird. I don't know what that was. Wait, what? Okay. Okay. And I'm trying to teleport again. No, 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 no. I really wish I would stop doing that. Alright, um, please start electrocuting him. So he is... He wants to... Where'd he go? He wants to rumble. He is flying, and I can't see. Where is he? Oh, he's up there? Are you going to make me come to you? Did his health just go down a little bit? Is he fighting somebody else up here? All right. No, that's not him. Where did he... He's too powerful to be frozen. Where'd he go? He's just flying to the wall? Like, what? Seriously. How do I keep losing him? Okay, he's in the mountain. That's cheating. That's... Alright. Yeah, get out of the... Stop flying into the mountain. That's cheating. Yeah, just stay right there. That, yeah, no, stay right there. No, don't. Alright, right, I'm sorry, but you attacked me first. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, he's got all kinds of things I don't want. I'll take this. Oh, what? What is this? Cannonade? A powerful elementalism spell which unleashes a cannonade? 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 Okay, a fireball which deal high fire damage. Um. It's an ingredient, so I'll take it because it's an ingredient. And, uh, nope, not taking any of this other stuff. Okay, well, that, that was, that was cool. But here's the problem. This I did read about. So, 
I have a tax here because of course I do. Um, that that's not the problem. So we need to do meditation, right? So he, he flips the bird because that's what it looks like he's doing every time he does it. He's just throwing up his middle finger like Stone Cold Steve Austin. Um, so in order for me to do elementalism, all right. So this is what I'm confused about. Yeah, I think I need this. Which I can get. Yeah, because I was confused about... Alright, so if I go in... Check it out, right? So if I go in and I try to use that spell book I just got. Because I was confused about this. Where'd it go? Da, 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 da. There it is. Mythical, right? So, like, you just read it. And it's like, you need to have a skill level of 90 or higher. Which I do. I think um, as well as the master memory of the corresponding magic school now, that's the part that confused me because we do already have the other one one other mythical book if you remember correctly while I'm in here I can use that one though so like I'm 45 episodes in and I'm just learning this now so I mean my elementalism is 104 it's being enhanced by some equipment. Even without the equipment on, I'm I'm over I'm definitely over ninety. Definitely over ninety. So let's get out of here. Alright, and let's see if we can make this work. So I didn't want this because it It doesn't matter when I'm using God mode. But I didn't realize by not taking it that I was Making it so that way I couldn't use the mythical spell. So now let's now theoretically now I should be able to use this, right? Yes. All right. Cool, cool, cool. So let's take a look at that then. That's fire, though. First of all, let's put. Well, I need to get out of here. All right. Um, elementalism unleashes a. We're still 95 points of damage. We'll try it. Can I try it in here? No. Alright, let's get out of here then. <coughs> Excuse me. So I never did the bounties in Ark either. The bounties are kind of fun. Bounty quests are always kind of fun. So as soon as we're out of here... Alright, he's still wibble jibbling. Don't come back to life. That'd be freaky. So... Alright, let's put all the right things back on. I don't... I don't want... The Arctic Wing back on, please. Shock Nova doesn't work because of God Mode for some reason. And that's... And honestly, that's fine. <laughs> I, you know, because Arctic Wind's been working really well. Um, and we're going to put on... We well, did put it on already, right? Yes, it's on. Alright, so. <laughs> Can I move when I'm doing that? No. So I'm literally just a fire. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Alright, we'll leave that on for now. We will leave that on for now. And. Kind of a weird place to wrap it up, looking at the poor dead Myrad. Still not super happy I, I had to do that, but we'll just pretend he had rabies or something, and I had to I had to put him out of his misery. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. Alright, this has been episode 45 of Enderall Forgotten Stories. I am looking at Bad Titan. With all that being said, I bid you adieu. Goodbye and good night, Pathless. Thank you so very much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Have a good night.